Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to season eight, where the platform where we speak for the power. I'm sure they're going to show you this, play you this video here. I'm going to take it to the top so you can see. There's a video you will see um, coming up shortly. Um, the video you can see that's the people people in the local community area. It's a place I think it's called Owo, um, Ifan Road. I think it's called Owo. Um, and um, basically in Owo, that's how bad the roads are. Now, before we read that, I, before I play the video, I want you to listen to these particular words. Sovereignty belongs to the people of Nigeria from whom the government, through this constitution, derives all its powers and authority. That area there, Owo, is in the local government area. It is within the local government area. Those people in Owo, that area, they have sovereignty. They have something called sovereignty. And all of them there, instead of complaining and saying the roads are bad and everything else, they need to come together and begin to hold the local government, local government chairman, state house of assembly member, house of reps, senators, even governors, demand that they come to a, a um, town hall meeting where they can explain to you where the monthly allocation for this local government area has gone why the roads are this bad. So the people here, they are all sovereigns and they need to exercise their sovereignty. The people in here, they are all sovereigns and they need to exercise it. But let's play the video first. Then I'll come and explain the second part. Oh my God. See the roads? See how bad they are? This is Osa Road. Osa Road. You see that? Osa Road. Everywhere is blocked. Oh. You see? You see? As you can see now, this is Osa Road. You see that? Everywhere is blocked. Mm -hmm. Look at how bad the roads are. No road to go to our class of going Owa. to Akure. You see? Oh, Akure. Everywhere is blocked. Oh. Now. As you can see now, see. everywhere is blocked. You see that? No going back. You see? You see that? This is Ifan Road. Oh. Ifan Road. Everywhere is blocked. You can see now. You can see everybody. Some four days, three days, they are here. You see now? Three days, four days, they are here. Everywhere is blocked. Please, government, you should help us. So well, the government... are going to school, there's no road. The government will not do anything because Please. the government will not do anything or war. So I'm going to find a war. Let's go and look at a war. Because I talk about a war, right? Let's go and find a war. This is the disbursement for January 2023. You can see there. So let's quickly go and look at a war. Let's find out what a war is. I think it says Akure. I believe that is in uh, uh, Akure. Uh, let me see. We'll, we'll, find that. we'll find out anyway. We'll find out. I'll find out. I think it's... Uh, I think I know what... What local government is that? That is Ida in the Undoe Kitty, I think it is. So let me just check something quickly. One second, please. Undo State, exactly. So, so, or war. Yeah. Or war. So we're going to find out or war. Let's go and look for or war. Uh, how much they got in January. And the roads are bad in or war. So this is what we need to be doing. I'm trying to show you what you need to do in each of the local. So we're looking for Ondo State. OPQR. Ondo State. Or your. Or your. Or shun. Ondo. Or war. Right. Okay. That's or war. Can you see that? I don't know if you can see. I'm trying to, I'll make it bigger. That's over there, right? Let me move it in here. See, that's over. You see, it says over. Now, if we go to the end, we will take the map to the end to see over. So, over, you saw it there. So, over received 291,310,304 
uh, Naira and 24 Kobo in January of 2023. 20, uh, and what are the state? What is the state of the road? So let's go back again to show you. I want to, so this is what you need. You need this information or war. Sorry. Sorry about that. Let me go back. I think I've gone a bit too far. Or war. Here we go. So this is all war here. So you can see all war there. So I'm going to move forward. you see me come up with that figure there. So, so you can see that. So that's a figure for all war. I wonder if this will let me go. Will you let me go there? Hang on. I'm trying to just show you all war. 291 something. Here we go. So so we're going to just show you all war again. So you see that? It says all war there. See? Now, so when I go back down, you can see that's all war. So they are receiving this amount. So And that's the road for all war. That's 291 million. Now, how much would it take to fix that road? It's not going to cost, it won't even cost you 10 million. I don't think it will even cost you 10 million to fix this. You know, I, I, I'm just estimating. But look at the look at the state of the road. What you need to do is we now you need to go with that information that I just showed you for a war and use the powers you have here. It says sovereignty. Everybody that is in here, they are sovereigns. If you're if you're in the Owo local government area, you are a sovereign. Sovereignty belongs to the people of Nigeria, from whom the government, through its constitution, derives all its powers and authority. Now, how do you use that power? by active participation in your governance. You now go to the local government area and you say, look, this is how much you got last year, uh, this this month. for just, And that's a monthly statement. Oh, that's a monthly statement. Sorry, let me just quickly. I'm going to try and go there so that it makes it easier. I right, have to see if you can see it. Can you see it? No, you can't. Is it here? You can't. Okay. So I'm going to have to do this then. So I'm just trying to make it crisp closer so you can see it. Now, so that's that's a war. So that's the amount there. Let me move it forward a little bit more. So that's that's the amount there for a war. Uh, let me just go forward so I'll show you again so that you don't think I'm like, you know, so this says a war there. So now we're not go back. So I want you to be able to see that figure just above my head uh, or just uh, thereabouts. I just want to make sure you can see it. Can you see it? Uh, I don't know if you can see it, but I'm going to move it forward. So I'm going to move it forward. Okay, it's behind me. Okay, that's fine. I'm going to make sure you... I want to make sure you can see. That's why I'm not trying to... So here, you can see it there now. Almost, almost. You can almost see it. You peep out there. Okay, I see what's going on now. So now, that's it there. Sorry. That's it there, right there. Can you see that? That's 291. So that's the figure there, you see? And that's the figure for a war. I'm trying to deliberately show that so you can see what it is. It just moved down. Sorry. So here we go. Oh, well. so we go back down again. So what you do is you go with that information, which you see above my head. You see that figure there? 291. You see? Once you go, now you now take that figure and you call a local uh, a, a, a town hall meeting with your local government chairman, state house of assembly members, house of reps and senators, and even God know where you can. As many of them, and tell them, this is the state of our road. So this road here, you see, look at that. Complaining is not going to be enough. You need to be actively participating in your governance. See? See that? And how do you participate? No, it's not, look, it's not good enough. Some have been here for four days, six days. You see? There's no road. You see? You see? Nigeria, you should please help you us. See? So. You see, it's not good if enough I to... Way. You see? As you can see now. See that? Everywhere is blocked. So. 
So this what I'm what I'm saying here is this: you need to use these powers that you have here. How do you use it? You now go to the sector. The sovereignty is now used by the way of active participation in your government. You call those people, local government chairmen, state of assembly members, house of reps, senators, even governors, to a town hall meeting and tell them this is how much you are receiving every month. Last month you received this amount, and you can quote me. You can quote me for that area. You can quote me that last um, last month they received for uh, um, a war. Yes. Two hundred ninety-one million three hundred ten thousand six hundred four naira and twenty-four kobo. Just one month. Where's that money going? That's the question you should be asking. Without you actively participating in your governance, your roads will not improve. So when they are saying God, government help us, so you need to you have to hold them to account. If I were stress free, you have to hold them to account using the powers that I'm showing you here. So let's play pray. They press play and you can hear. as you can see now you have to hold them to account everywhere is you see, local you are all sovereign everybody everywhere there is if local. you are in, if you are born in that area or you live in that Please, area Nigeria you're sovereign also, you see four days Nigeria, she, she help also. it's not about asking nigeria to help nigeria, you need to hold them to account you see you see? You see? Before war, express road. Before war. Yes. As you can see now. Before war, express road. We're in a bondage, oh, please. You school also. Press school also. You see? What that, what I'm telling you, instead of begging them, exercise your sovereignty. Exercise your sovereignty. Hold your governance to account. We are trying to show you how we're going to do it, and I'm going to be doing a live broadcast in both in Yoruba and, 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 and in English. This is what you need to do. You need to take action. Start standing around and saying, please, help us, help us. They will not listen. You need to activate the powers that you possess. And we're showing you the steps to take to hold your government to account. Please share this broadcast. The song, How Long Will I Go To Suffer, is asking you, how long? Will you keep saying, help us, help us? They're not going to listen to you. You need to take active action. Use section 14 2 way. Sovereignty belongs to the people of Nigeria from whom the government, through this constitution, derives all its powers and authority. Every single person in that area, they are all sovereigns. They need to come together and hold their local government area to account, including local government chairman, state house of assembly members, house of reps, senators, even the governors. Call them to a town hall meeting. Demand they come and see the road. Demand that they use the funds. Tell them about the 291 million naira that, I could, that they got paid in January. They get paid money every month. That money should be used to fix that road. If you do not begin to hold them to account, nothing is going to work. They, you will not get anything fixed by begging. Help us, help us is not good enough. You need to exercise your powers. You need active participation in your government to get infrastructure in your local government area. You have to become active participants in your government. The church or the mosque will not provide solve this solution for you, provide solutions. It's when you come together and collectively exercise your sovereignty. That's when you will get infrastructure in your community. That's what I'm trying to show you. I hope you find this beneficial. But the video is safe. I mean, it's begging. Begging is no longer going to, it's not going to work. You need to become active participants in your local government area, collectively holding your governance to account, standing together and holding them to account. Let's watch it to the end anyway, and I'll just show you. Suffering here. So, see. On Saifon Road. You see. Nigeria, you should please help us. So. We are suffering now. See, everybody in that picture, like I said, they are all sovereigns, but they don't know it. They don't know that they're sovereigns. We are here to try and help you. You are a sovereign. The picture that you see on the screen is demonstrating something, one simple thing to you. And that is that you're a sovereign, you have powers. We want you to use those powers. You see, sovereignty belongs to the people of Nigeria from whom the government, through its constitution, derives all its powers and authority. Everybody watching us in that area, if you are living in that local government area, you are a sovereign. You need to come together collectively and hold your local government chairman, state of assembly, house of assembly members, um, uh, house of reps and senators and governors, Hold them to account. Tell them to explain where that money, this money here, they need to explain to you where the 291 million went for a war. They need to explain that to you. 
You see? Or what? That, that amount that you're seeing there, where's that money gone? They need to explain that to you. And you have a right to ask them because why? Sovereignty belongs to you all collectively. You need to do this collectively. We are trying to show you the steps you need to take. It is no longer enough. So I've shown you the money. We've shown you the... We, 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 you've talked about the problem. Good. Now you have to be part of the solution. How do you become part of the solution? By taking active participation in your local governance on a monthly basis. This is how much we received... Our roads are bad. Instead of saying, God, look at federal government, help us. They're not going to help you. It is when you begin to hold them to account using the powers that you possess, which I, we are showing you. Every local community, you can do this. And I will come back and do a live broadcast again and talk about this particular one. You, it is very, very important. This is very key. Everybody in there, you possess collective power, but you don't know it. And we're trying to show you how you can get to be using those powers. And, and, and in fact... I will come and do this in Yoruba because I'm going to trans I've already translated it in Yoruba. And you can use those powers to actually hold your governors to account and demand that they comply with their own, with that constitution. It's when you stand together. When you stand together, they cannot ignore you. If you stand individually, nothing will change. But you need to come together as a community. You are all suffering. Look at that. Just standing there, I'm just waiting. God, government, nothing's going to change. Using these powers will change things. I want you to have a belief that you have the you possess that power, and it is in use the collective use of that power that you will get the infrastructure that you need in your community. So let's watch it to the end and see what they say. But um, keep that in mind. There you go. Why in a bondage, Joe? Please, rascal, also. You see, you see that? You see how bad? You see that? So that's how bad. So everybody just standing there watching. They don't even know the powers I'm showing you. Take a screenshot of this, please. Take a screenshot of this and show it to people. Let them know that they possess powers. They possess the power. Sovereignty belongs to you. Exercise your sovereignty by holding your governors to account through active collective participation. That's what I'm going to put down as a heading for this. Leave a comment. The song, How Long? It's a song I wrote by Citizen AY. Uh, please do help us um, share the song. Uh, the, the broadcast. Go down to Season AY on YouTube. Download it um, on, 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 on iTunes and Spotify. It's on iTunes and Spotify. How long? How long will I go this offer? It resonates. Um, we, it's the idea is to wake you up, to get you to uh, question your governance. And we, we are giving you information. The, what is on the screen is the information that you need, exactly the information that you need to hold your governance to, your, your, to account in your local government area. You have the powers. We encourage you, you to use it. I'll come back and talk about this on a live broadcast. You see, I've shown you the monthly allocation. I've shown you, the, I've told you about the people that you need to speak to. I've told you this. I've even went to the amount for the lo this particular local government area, what they received in January 2023. So there is money. What you need to begin to do is begin to hold those who are in office, hold them to account. Where's those money gone? That's what we're trying to get you to do. I hope you all, um, uh, you know, find this useful. Leave comments. Uh, what are your thoughts? Take a screenshot of the powers that you possess. Take a screenshot of it and share it. You, of course, watch this is anyway, the platform where we speak truth to power. About later on, please share this broadcast and let us uh, create more awareness because it's time for our people to become active participants in our government. No longer might we just say help us alone. We need to use those powers. We possess the powers. They've, they've trained us not, they've, they've somehow closed our, our eyes to no, not knowing that we have the powers and we need to use those powers. And please, Anybody watching this, share it. Share this particular information because people need to know that they have the power and they, to, to, to question the government collectively. And they have to get the, the government has to do the bidding of the people who elected them into office. So please share, share, and share. You of course watching Citizen AY, the platform where we speak to the power. When you get the broadcast, please do share, share, and share. And leave a comment and let's hear from you. It's really important. These are key ways you can actually empower yourself. We don't believe in just saying God help us alone. No, that's no. You need to take collective action. And we're showing you the steps you can take to take collective action. So you have watching Citizen AY, the platform where we speak to the power. Please subscribe. Hit the notification button. Give us a thumbs up. One more time. We'd like you to go ahead and do what? Subscribe to Citizen AY. Yeah? Subscribe. Hit the notification button. Finally, give us a thumbs up. Thank you very much. Hope you found this useful. Please share the broadcast. Um, you know, it's no longer enough to just cry, help us. You need, to, you need to take what you need is to become active participants in your governance. So, 
use this as a as a as a, as a video that we can share. It's, it's it's got all the information you need in it. We've talked about how you can actually access the uh, the multi allocation through not, um, National Bureau of Statistics. Again, I've done a video about this on this platform. Just look for, look it up. Type NBS and it will come up, and you can see it. But I'll talk about it again live. I've even shown you how you can go into your local government area and know how much you're receiving on a month by month basis. I've done it live here. Please do share this podcast. You're watching Citizen Network, the platform where we speak truth to power. It is only through active participation of we, the citizens and our governance, will we get infrastructure. And that is the message I want to put across. Please share this podcast. Know the powers. Study those powers. Like I've, uh, Share it. Keep a picture. Take a screenshot of the, 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 the section 14.2 and 14.2c. Take a screenshot of it. Put it in your phone. Share it to everybody you know. It is of immense importance. This is how we begin to make changes. Everybody who is in this video is a sovereign, but they don't know it. And our job is to try and make you be aware that you're a sovereign. And collectively, using that sovereignty, you will hold your governors to account to fix the road because sovereignty belongs to the people of Nigeria, from whom the government, through its constitution, derives all its powers and authority. They derive powers from you. So you have to exercise that power to make sure that to make your life better, you have to participate in your governance actively on a daily basis monitoring the month where the funds are going and what is being used for and you have the power to do so your watches is never the platform where we speak to the power about the thank you and bye for